So I'm just fielding some questions here for USMLE. I am asked a rather specific question. I'm eight weeks out from my step two, only 8% through UWorld, OMG, what do I do? Okay, I've made other uh, videos on more general topics, okay? But this one, we're just gonna entertain for specificity purposes. If you're studying for step one, I'll also address uh, your prep as well, okay? If you're eight weeks out, only 8% through UW. Before we get started, please subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. Help grow this channel. Please share with one of your friends who's prepping for USMLE. Help bring awareness to this channel. Hit the like button. Hit the bell if you want notifications. And find me on Instagram at melman underscore medical, M-E-H-L-M-A-N underscore medical. And the link is down below. Now let me start the fucking question. So Salar Sarwar Khan asks, Eight weeks out for my step two, only 8% through UWorld, OMG, what do I do? Now look, you're eight weeks out, you need to switch, you need to drop UW. No, I'm not joking. You need to drop UW, apart from the self-assessment exams, which you can do. You need to drop QBank and you need to instantaneously focus all of your energies onto the clinical mastery series forms, the subject specific NBME forms. PEDS, obsingaini, psych, surgery, emergency, FM, etc. Okay, you need to go through these forms. You need to also go through forms six, seven, eight, uh, because you're eight weeks out at the time of this clip, July 2021. Nine, ten, eleven are going to be online fairly soon. You need to go through all this NBME material, as I've talked about in my other clips. The NBME is the US simile. It's not. A, it's not a debate. Okay, so the questions you're doing from the clinical mastery series forms and the online actual uh, full-length NBME exams, it's the same as the USMLE, okay? You wanna get your score up as much as possible in the final eight weeks, recognize that going through this NBME content, this is the way to do it. The USMLE is not USMLE RX, it's not Kaplan, it's not AMBOSS, it's not UWorld. You need to do the NBME content. Students will walk out of the exam, sometimes they say the questions are more similar to UW than the NBME, it's not fucking true. The USMLE is the NBME. It's not a debate. This isn't like speculative, okay? The questions are exactly the same. So you need to calibrate your thinking style to the NBMEs in the final eight weeks. You need to drop UW. I know that that sounds astonishing to many people, but the piece of value that I need to inculcate is that the USMLE is not fucking you world, okay? It's the NBMEs. It's the subject specific material from clinical mastery series. If you're studying for step one, it's NB, it's the NBME exam. So you need to do if you're eight weeks out and eight percent through you world, you need to drop UW QBank right now. You need to do forms twenty through twenty four offline. You need to memorize your incorrects. So you're going to screenshot them into a into a Word document, save as a PDF or a PowerPoint. You're going to review three days per exam, that's ideal. It's gonna differ depending on the students. I'm giving you just an umbrella type of discussion right now, but you're gonna review 20 through 24, hardcore, memorize those exams. You're going to go through my free PDFs, which I've developed on my website, uh, with, from the offline NBME material, NBME six through 18, okay? The concepts are the same. So you're gonna have a very strong backing of NBME material. Then you're gonna go into forms 25 through 30. Okay, and if you bring up the notion of being able to finish this material quickly, then sure, we can have you integrate some parts of UW as buffer, but in general, for most students, it's going to entail dropping UW and focusing on the NBME exams right now. Maybe that's not what your friends told you. Run, run, run your friends through a Skype session with me, and they're not gonna be talking about doing QBank in the final eight weeks. Okay, it's a matter of being introduced to information that sometimes is novel, but is most beneficial for you. Okay, once again, I know you are studying for the step two, Solar. Okay, so what you're going to do is drop uh, UW QBank. You're going to focus on the clinical mastery series info. You're going to go through form six, seven, eight. You're going to memorize all those questions, including your incorrects. Focus on your incorrects, and then then you can go focus on the corrects. And if you feel like you're very fast to finish that material, then we can integrate not just my PDFs, but also UW as buffer. But UW is not your priority right now. You need to drop it and focus on the uh, actual NBME content, okay? This could be a long discussion. 
some of you guys are going to have questions now. I probably created more questions than I answered, okay? So I'm obviously going to make more content. You know the deal. If you like my stuff, subscribe to my channel. And I appreciate your time. That's it.